Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey appear to be pursuing some normalcy as their romance flourishes in the public eye by presenting each other to their families. Because parent approval is the ultimate signed, sealed, delivered statement. Swift and Kelsey have been cited out and about with each other's parents on several occasions. And last weekend was Taylor's time to shine, having supported her boyfriend at multiple Kansas City Chiefs games alongside Travis's parents. While Taylor's mother Donna Kelsey was seen watching Taylor's The Era's Tour concert film in Florida, Travis was seen enjoying her performance in Argentina in a VIP tent with her father, Scott Swift. Kelsey Donna Donna Kelsey, a native of Cleveland, is a proud mother of NFL stars Travis and Jason. Donna, who has been seated next to Swift at multiple Chiefs games, has been reserved when speaking to the media about her son's connection. In October, she acknowledged on the Today Show that her time with Swift was okay. It's just one of those situations where everyone clearly noticed me. Alongside, Swift, in the crates was me. It's just something more that has accelerated in my life, Donna remarked. After more than a month, Mama Kelsey appeared to have softened, going to a Swift Era's tour movie screening in Central Florida. A woman who was extremely similar to Kelsey's mother entered the movie theater, as spotted by muralist and Swift enthusiast Danielle Sparks. Sparks said the woman was with a buddy on Fox News Digital. They were really laid back throughout the entire film, everybody else was having a great time, singing and dancing. And it appeared as though they were only taking in the scene. It's a lengthy movie, after all. She and the rest of us sat there and watched it. Sparks felt compelled to speak up when the women crowded into the toilet after the movie ended. When Sparks brought up the first thing to Donna's friend, the friend pretended that the similarity was merely a coincidence. Donna introduced herself after using the loo, although she was quick to add that she was just a mom. I thought, no. You are the matriarch. You're such a wonderful mother to such wonderful kids. It really is a major thing. Don't just brush it under the rug, Sparks recalled telling her. It was very kind of her to allow my mother-in-law to take a picture of me and her together. You realize that she didn't have to do that? When Sparks claims Mama Kelsey went outside to try to snap a photo with her buddy using the Taylor movie marquee, that's when things got weird. I asked, oh, would you like me to just take your picture? Like, I can accomplish it, Sparks recalled inquiring. And she replied, no. Actually, that's true. I'm grateful. I must email one to Travis to let him know that I attended the film. And I thought, really? Sparks continued, my husband and I were talking about it, and I think she's probably just so thrilled that her kids are doing so well. As though you wouldn't exchange that for anything. She is thus doing everything in her power to encourage them. Sparks did see that Donna declined her friendship bracelet with Grace. At Swift's concerts, her fans frequently trade bracelets. Kelsey, Ed Ed, the ex-husband of Donna Swift and father of Travis Kelsey, recently revealed what he thought was the cutest thing about Swift, a very, very sweet, very charming, down-to-earth young woman. Ed and Donna divorced after 25 years of together. Even now, the two remain close friends. Ed said to People Magazine, I'll tell you something very special that I noticed about Taylor the first time I met her. In the suite, we're seated. She stands up and enters the living room. She starts to gather up empty bottles, cans, and plates that are lying around when she gets up to go grab a drink or something. Because everyone in the suites gets something, and you just throw it everywhere you can. I feel like she didn't get the diva memo, he stated, speaking of the 12-time Grammy Award winner. She failed to grasp the pampered musician. It's beyond her ability to pull that off. And that actually said a lot to me. Swift showed up to her first Kansas City Chiefs game in week three of the NFL season to support Kelsey. The celebrity was seen cleaning up in a fan shot video while seated in a suite with Donna. 
Travis made light of his father's meetings with Swift in an episode of his joint podcast New Heights with brother Jason. If you watched the game, you witnessed a historic event. Jason started, Taylor Swift is speaking with Ed Kelsey. Yes, Taylor is speaking with Dad. You and Dad are familiar, just as I am, said Travis. Jason laughed and continued, which is, he shouldn't be talking to Taylor. This conversation is horrifying. I felt awful, stated Travis. He's basically giving her a lot of attention. He turned up the volume on her music a bit further. Jason commented, it was nice because mom has been getting quite a bit of the spotlight regarding Donna. So, it was cool to see dad up there on the Jumbotron. Swift Scott. Former financial advisor Scott Swift is very close to his daughter. Before relocating to Tennessee to support Swift's career, he and his ex-wife Andrea reared Swift and their son Austin in a remote area of Pennsylvania. Scott was frequently seen filming his daughter when she performed, acting like a devoted father. He was also seen wearing a chief's lanyard and standing close to the tight end. On November 12, Kelsey was in Swift's home territory when he attended her Saturday night performance in Argentina. When Swift's song Karma was altered to incorporate a reference to Kelsey, the two men enjoyed a tender moment together. Karma is the guy on the Chiefs, coming straight home to me, she crooned. A fan posted a video of Scott and Travis rejoicing at the lyric change. Swift Andrea. Despite their divorce, Scott and Andrea are often seen together and by Swift's side at her most emotional times. In this Meet the Parents story, Andrea, the daughter of American opera star Marjorie Finley, is the lone evasive parent. Andrea and Travis have not yet been pictured together in public, despite the possibility that she has already met her daughter's new boyfriend. Swift has written multiple songs about her mother, with whom she is close.